ragtag guy here um, called Edward Fenninger. Edward Fenninger um, seems to have some type of sinister agenda. And I'll read from Jeremiah 5, uh, chapter 26. For among my people... For among my people are found wicked men that lay wait as he that setteth snares. They set a trap, they catch men. That's Jeremiah chapter 5, verse 26. And that's exactly what this um, Edward Fenninger is doing. I just wanted to show the agenda of this man because it goes back all the way. And I'll just zoom in here quickly so you can kind of see. Because this is frightening, actually, when you look at like what's going on and how they're attacking Bible-believing Christians. I can just go back to 11 months here. And from 11 months ago, this guy, pretty much every day, has been making videos against Brian Denlinger. And we'll just scroll up here. But this is definitely agenda, and it's a hate-filled agenda. And that's why I read Jeremiah 5.26. Um, for among my people are found wicked men that lay wait. Again, nine months here, Brian Denglinger, um, Brian Denglinger, Brian Denglinger, Brian Denglinger, Brian Denglinger. Like, the guy spends his whole day just attacking Brian Denglinger. He'll attack um, Brian, Denglinger's, Brian Denglinger's evil lies about interracial marriage, part seven, part six, part five, part four. Like, he just goes, and these are all like, look at this, an hour long, 41 minutes? This is how long this guy's spending in front of the camera talking to people. I wonder how much scripture he's actually using. But then what scripture is he using? Because Brian seems to use the real scriptures rightly divided by the word of God through proper dispensation and proper biblical teaching through the Holy Spirit, which he has dwelt inside of him. So this is, to me, vexing in my spirit. Because here you have a person purposely put out an agenda to lie to people. And by tagging Brian in the name and in the taglines of all these, he's trying to overwrite the searches. So when people look for the truth, they'll just get all these heresy videos, which don't actually lead to anything. And they'll lead you away from the truth. And again, months and months and months of doing this, and he just keeps going on. Like this is, this is asinine. This is, this is insane. And again, so like 20 hours ago, he made a Brian Denlinger hypocrisy regarding Max Bauer video, part two. 21 hours ago. So that's one hour apart. Okay. Then one day ago, he attacks Brian again. Six days, 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 six days. Like just off the charts. This guy is a sociopath. And that's putting it politely. This man has a devil inside of him, and his agenda is Roman Catholicism 101. Um, because again, where's the propaganda coming from? Is he teaching other scriptures? No, he's not. He's basically attacking one person or a few people, but pr mostly Brian. This is how this goes. So these people are all lost, and they're all in collusion together. And that all goes back, and there's another guy I wanted to bring up, Bible Berean. He, he, he's just a mess, too. Because this guy also, he triggered me when I saw him because he believes in this Trinitarian um, aspect, which is nothing more than Catholic Doctrine 101. And let's see here. So we have King's Table. He's another one of those um, promoters on the side. I'll just show him his, this little thing there. Oh, Avatar. And you go to King's Table, and what's he doing? Um, so ever since one month ago, he has been all over attacking Brian Denlinger, Brian Denlinger too. Um, and it's just, you listen to this guy, and you think like, okay, you're just speaking out of your own righteousness as well. You're not backing up any fact with doctrine. Um, you're not leading people to the scriptures so they'd be saved in the knowledge of the truth and by the Lord Jesus Christ and the shed blood that he did at Calvary um, for the death, burial, and resurrection. None of it, none of it, none of it. No repentance, no none of it. Um, they hate on people that uh, lead, lead anyone away from the church because they think church is in the Bible. They really don't like that because that, that goes after their doctrines. Um, but these guys have an agenda. They're, like you cannot have, a, their opinions are so biased and their patterns are so similar that anybody in their right mind would have to say that these guys are being sent out to attack specific people and defame them and throw out propaganda and divide and conquer. Um, 
and so that's King's table. And so, yeah, you'll see him commenting on, um, on these videos here. Here's another uh, evil Crichton. And uh, his name is Book of Relief. And um, what is he doing as well? Oh, surprise, surprise. Two hours ago, five days ago, six days ago, two weeks ago, two weeks ago. Let's, uh, let's bring up the uploads here. So Book of Relief. He seems to be on the same page as the rest of these um, militants. Ever since two months ago, all he's doing is attacking Brian. Exposing for heresy the Godhead. Um, Brian Dinglinger's Godhead heresy exposed. Part 10. So he made 10 videos. I wonder if they're all 35 minutes long. You're going to sit in your house all day doing the same thing? Like, this is it. Grown men doing this. This is grown men sitting on YouTube doing this. If you go to Lamentations chapter 4, verse 18. Zoom back out here. So chapter 4, verse 18. They hunt our steps that we cannot go in our streets. Our end is near, our days are fulfilled, for our end is come. Our persecutors are swifter than the eagles of the heaven. They pursued us up upon the mountains. They laid wait for us in the wilderness. Is that not exactly what these people are doing? They hunt our steps. They pursued us upon the mountains. They laid wait for us in the wilderness. It's exactly what's going on. So yeah, Book of Relief in this whole ragtag band. They'll they'll profess that they're they're Baptists and whatever they want to say they are, but they're they're none of this. Absolutely none of it. Do they put out the scriptures that that are the same as what the Spirit would lead you to in the King James Bible? No, they never do. I can watch any of these videos. And it's just never the same. And you know that because the scriptures tell you that. That uh, if, they were, if they were all the same mind, if we were all the same mind, it wouldn't have a problem. But it's not the case. <clears throat> so, yeah, just getting back to Ed here. Again, every day, every hour of the day, that's sociopathic. And so that's why I'm just going to kind of finish the video there. Um, you'll see this a lot on the internet. You'll see anyone um, putting out any real truth from the King James Bible and uh, taking it literally. Um, God's word taking it literally and uh, showing evidence again against the, the Roman Catholic Church and its evil deeds. And the wicked people out there that are upholding these things. Um, they, they just get fervently attacked. No coincidence that all these people... Um, are solely throwing arrows at Brian and they all have trace amounts of Catholicism in them.